How long do you think it'll take before he's widely considered the best striker in the world? <laughs> um, uh, I don't, I don't know, but uh, um, yeah, I, I hope uh, we will have uh, fun with him for for a very long time, as long as possible. I, I don't think that is uh, that Dortmund is just a way station uh, for him. And uh, yeah, we are very proud that we are playing in the offense with two 20 years olds and one uh, 70 year old with Gio Reyna in the first lineup. And uh, yeah, that's pretty cool, and that makes us uh, 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 yeah very proud. And um, yeah, uh, as I as I said, uh, we want to see him here in, in Dortmund as long as possible. And um, yeah, uh, yeah, here in, now in the present, uh, we are very happy that he's. Uh, playing for Dortmund. Uh, now on Saturday we're going to see Holland against Lewandowski. Lewandowski obviously a, a player that you know very well. Just the same. What are some of the key differences between them? We know they're both great. They both score a lot of goals. But but what makes them different? Uh, uh, that's, uh, that's difficult. I think uh, both are mentally uh, strong. Both understand the demands of the game tactically. Both are athletes, uh, um, yeah, both have a good feeling uh, for the game. They can strike a ball very well. Uh, his, their ability to run at top speed is great. Breaking into boxes, scoring goals. I think the difference is that, is, uh, that Haaland is very young. Uh, um, Lewandowski is uh, yeah, more than 30 years old. But he, he performed on this level for... I think 10 or 12, 12 years yeah? and for for uh, Haaland it's the first season in, in the Bundesliga and so that is uh, that is the only difference. Uh, I'd be remiss if I didn't ask you about Gio Reyna and what you think of him. Do you remember maybe not the first time you saw him play but that first moment where you said okay this kid is good not just to get into the first team but to really make a difference once he gets to that level. Yeah, he, he uh, was uh, or he is um, uh, one of the most promising uh, young talents uh, uh, worldwide. Uh, yeah, he, he has a an, an, an keen eye uh, for the killer pass. Uh, um, yeah, he's uh, a good, very good teammate. So he's able to make other players uh, uh, better. And um, yeah, you have to be blind if you if you. Uh, uh, wouldn't have see, uh, seen his, uh, yeah, his, his strengths and his abilities or his, his talent. So he became the youngest American, I think, with 17 years uh, ever to uh, ever to appear in the in the Bundesliga. Um, he became the youngest goal scorer in uh, German Cup history. So uh, it's it's uh, really marvelous and. Um, yeah, so um, uh, fortunately, uh, I think uh, his father and his mother were both uh, uh, footballers. So, um, yeah, I think he has his talents uh, uh, from, from, uh, from the parents. Yeah, it, it was uh, so nice uh, to have him here. And, um, yeah, he, he deserved it because uh, he deserved uh, to become a, a player in our, in our first team in the first lineup because... In each training session, in each uh, match, even in the uh, uh, in the youth department, uh, when he played in our under nineteen, he wants uh, uh, to become better, and he wants uh, to put uh, uh, to to raise his uh, level on a higher uh, level. And um, yeah, so it's it's so great to see him here in Dortmund. When people talk about Erling Holland, there seems to be very little doubt that he will eventually become one of the best players in the world. Do you feel the same way about Reyna? Because here in the United States, we've never really had that player who you could say was among the best in the world. <laughs> yeah, I think uh, uh, there's another guy, Christian Pulisic. Uh, he played in Dortmund uh, as, as well. And um, um, yeah, he was uh, uh, such a great player uh, uh, as as well as um, uh, Gio, and uh, yeah, both are uh, bursting with with confidence, and uh, uh, yeah, so they are so physical uh, in in the midfield, and uh, but they are still uh, very young. Uh, uh, Christian is now playing in in Chelsea, and uh, yeah, they have to make uh, their experience. They uh, have to play. Uh, 
you know, on a very high level in the Bundesliga, in the Champions League, with the national teams. And then they have, uh, they have the chance to, to, become, uh, uh, to become the uh, next superstars in, in football. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.